Hi, I'm with Nate Grenier and Jason Cox. Uh, Jason is a volunteer and goes on missions. Tell us a little about the trip to El Salvador. Yeah, so Emerson's House of Refuge partners with a group called CD Infa in El Salvador. Um, they sponsor different children in the communities. They also have carpentry workshops, bakery workshops to help empower some of the adults to be able to have a better future. And Emerson's House just goes and stands beside them and works with them for the weeks or the two weeks that we're there. Okay. And Nate Grenier, who owns Coffee Connections on Main Street in Old Hilliard, went on his first mission in June. Uh, tell us a little about that, Nate. Yeah, sure. It was a wonderful experience. I was able to take uh, my wife and our three of our four daughters with us and a couple of our staff as well just to get involved in my friend's life. Uh, he loves El Salvador and working down there and volunteering to make some great things happen. And so we wanted to go down there to see what they're doing, how can we help out, not just as a, co as a company, but also as a business. And uh, so we got some really, it was a really wonderful experience. Okay. On October 7th, Coffee Connections is hosting an open house uh, meant to raise awareness and support for this mission. Nate, tell us a little bit about that event. Sure, we're calling it Around the Bonfire. We're going to have hot dogs and a bunch of other food as well. And it's just a time to celebrate and to hear about what's going on and how it's happening and then what we're going to be doing in the future. Another thing we're also going to be doing is selling these mugs. Um, we brought the mugs down, but the kids at the ESL class actually painted these mugs. So we'll be selling these things just to kind of create awareness in the community. This is what we're doing as a small business to support a wonderful mission house that's working on uh, down in El Salvador. And this is our plan business, what we can do, and how you can be involved in that process. Okay. You can read more about this in thisweeknews.com. Thanks, Nate. Thanks, Jason.